Hey guys, how's it going? DJ Delirious here. I want to show you something on how to alphabetize your crate <clears throat> inside of Serato DJ. So I stumbled across this trying to figure out how can I get my crates in alphabetical order. I stumbled across this last night and figured maybe I'll share this with the DJ community. Probably something people want to know about if they don't already know and maybe I'd you know, maybe I'm just doing this the wrong way or whatever or something. But, okay, as you can see, all of my crates are in alphabetical order. Most of them, I didn't do all of them. I did a, quite a few of them, but I left some out of alphabetical order at the bottom here just for my own purposes. Left some of these out of alphabetical order. But up here, if you take a look at this, where we start down from here, acapella and instrumentals I have here. And then I have all clean, everything here. I got blues, club one, club two, hip hop, R&B, so club, so on and so forth. Well, you see here, I have this Chicago house crate here. Well, we see that that is a sub crate of the club pop and top 40 crate. I want this crate, the Chicago house crate here, to be in alphabetical order. So it goes between the blues and the club one crate up in this area. I don't know what's going on there. So I'm going to take this crate here, grab it with my mouse, Chicago House Crate. I'm going to grab it, click it with my mouse, hold it down, slide it over, and oh, actually I'm going to slide it up to here inside the blues. I wanted to go there, but it now became a sub crate of the blues crate. But I don't want it to be a sub crate of the blues crate. So again, I want it to be its own separate crate. So what I'm going to do is grab the crate again, click it, hold it with the mouse, and then I'm going to slide it to the left and it should become its own crate. When I let it go, now it's its own crate. You see how that switch? Chicago House is its own crate. So that's for anything here. Any crates that I have, if I wanted to put it in alphabetical order, I'll stop that alphabetical order when I got down in this area and below. So this stuff is not in alphabetical order, but the stuff up until this point, most of it, for the most part, is in alphabetical order, you know, except for these. These are my smart crates that I have tags on, and that they'll automatically go into those crates with the smart crate. Like this one here is 80s and 90s music, and then the stuff inside of that is the stuff that I have tagged, and, um, and uh, cue points and all that stuff, so I'm going to leave that like that. But if I didn't want this crate inside of here, I would take this crate, hold it, click on it, hold it, slide it to the left, and it can become its own crate. You see that? It's its own crate now. This crate is this crate. This crate is that crate. If I wanted this crate to go back into this 8090s and be a sub crate, just click on it, hold it, slide it up into that 8090s, and it becomes it's a sub crate of that crate now. So if any of this information helped anybody, let me know, you know, um, ask me a question, like the channel or yeah, like the channel, subscribe to like the video, subscribe to the channel. And then if you have any questions, you can ask me, ask me questions and I'll try to answer them and see if I can help you out with what I found out. So that's a quick way of how to alphabetize your crates. You can move them up, move them down and they'll become sub crates. But when they do, you just click on them, hold them. Slide them to the left, and they become their own crates again. That's how you get them in alphabetical order inside of Serato DJ. I don't even know if Serato DJ, the makers even know this, or the founders, or the software um, techs even know that. Maybe they do, but who knows. If they don't, now they do. That's how you make your crates alphabetical order. All right. Thanks, guys. See you later. DJ Delirious signing out.